Меня уже информировали, что канцлер Аденаур прислал своих недобитых нами под Сталинградом, которые шли в Советский Союз, пределы его уколи, а там мы так как укнули их сразу, понимаете, на три метра в землю, понимаете, вогнали. Так что вы, господа, укайте, да оглядывайтесь. Мы вас не добили под Сталинградом, на Украине, в Белоруссии. Если вы будете укать против нас и будете опять готовить нападение, мы так ухнем, что больше не будешь укать. make it back to safety. Um, during that time there was sporadic artillery and, and mortar fire in the woods. We weren't sure if it was directed at us or not, uh, but it meant that we had to um, pause a lot of the time and, and wait for things to be quiet again. Um, so we were in the woods for I think around six hours. Um, at some point we must have made a wrong turn or we were, we were wrong to, be, to begin with, but we um, somehow we entered a village uh, when we came up to a crossroads. Um, we were um, trying to determine what to do, and uh, that's when the uh, Russian forces uh, approached us. Um, we immediately put down our weapons and, and surrendered. Three Russians walked up to us and like said something in Russian. I, I, they ended up taking our weapons away from us. They asked us questions, just like general interrogation, to see like who we are, where we are. We had no phone or documentation. I was expecting to be executed on the spot. Um, but the Russians did not do that. They, um, they yeah, yes, they bound us and stuff like that. And um, but they like gave us water, food when we needed it. Um, they like at nighttime when we were sleeping there. Um, yes, they bounded our arms and legs so we wouldn't run away. Um, but it was really cold at night. They gave us blankets. So in in like Western media, like again like Ukraine. Like, like the West, and this isn't necessarily the U.S., it's like the West in general. They show destruction of when, like, the, like the, the, the February 24th, the like special operation. They don't tell you how bad the Ukrainian military is. How, again, the corruption, the incompetence, like I, I've seen a lot of incompetence. A lot of territorial defenses unit that I've met say that they're under-equipped, under-trained, and they don't know what they're doing. When I was eventually uh, surrendered and captured, uh, again, I was expecting just to be killed on the spot. But I was treated uh, humanely, uh, uh, like, like nicely, um, and I wasn't expecting that. It was, I was already in captivity when I was told about their mm -hmm. um, capture and sentencing. Um, so I don't know what they did to reach that sentencing, but I'm aware that um, I could be facing uh, a similar, similar fate as them. I, I wasn't really paying attention much to it, but I know that there were uh, British mercenaries that were captured and sentenced to death, um, and, and that's the extent I, I know of it. Mm -hmm. 